Hello everyone, I hope you're all having a lovely day. So, you're a Vignon user and you want to figure out how in the living frick can you get arm jiggle? Because we want to look like live, we want to move like a live 2D model, so how do we get this arm jiggle going? Well, allow me to show you how. Now, this is actually pretty simple, you hardly have to do anything, as long as you follow these steps. First and foremost, what you're going to do is you're going to join Suvadrill's Discord server. And what you're going to do is you're going to go into, um, basically there's a Vignon forum. And what you're going to do is you're going to look up pretty much, um, live 2D basically in the Vignon forums. And what's going to pop up is an arm sway forum that will basically be a download where you can download... Uh, which I recommend download Suvadrill's edit when it comes to the node part of the arm sway, but download the original pendulum chain that the uh, the person who created the setup um, basically distributed. So use that, and of course, um, I'll make sure to you can check out the person who made that graph in the description. So check them out. But yes, you're going to go into the Discord server, and you're going to basically. Um, download that, and then what you're going to do is once you download those two files, the uh, the node graph edit that has a hotkey sub, which I recommend, especially if you're a leap motion user, and then also um, the pendulum graph so we can create the jiggle. What you're going to do is you're going to go into the node graph basically, you're going to create, uh, you're going to add a new graph right here, and you're going to click on the load, and you're going to load in the arm sway. Uh, graph that you downloaded which should look something like this now for this one I did modify it so ignore the leap motion status ones um, those are the ones those are my edits basically this is a test version but it's gonna look somewhat similar to this uh, where it's going to have the the multiple um, arms here there are gonna be there is going to be an extra node uh, here that's going to be for the index I usually remove that um, but if you plan on actually manually posing your fingers and having the fingers also jiggle, then I recommend take your, your time um, adding the fingers. Like, you can look at how the arms here are set up and such, and then apply your knowledge to the fingers, basically. So, you know, study the graph, and you can definitely do more with this. And there's, there's also the part that has the hotkey as well, which is here. Once again, please ignore the leap motion part, but it's going to be this little guy right here. There's going to be a hotkey that is F3. So basically, when you press on F3, it's going to disable the jiggle, which is great for leap motion users. Now, how do you get the jiggle to actually work? Well, what you're going to do is you're going to go into the pendulum chain, and you're going to click on import chain and you're going to import the said um, pendulum chain for the arm sway and it's going to look something like this sadly for some reason and I don't understand why the preview does not show the pendulum chain but the number I think it was like four uh, which it says right here so I believe it's four but yeah I don't know why it's not popping up but either way um, I'm sure that'll get fixed in the future but basically though um, pretty much by default, this should be set up, and pretty much, for the most part, you're pretty much done for the, uh, you're pretty much done for that. And, um, if you by any chance don't see the arms moving, then please reset Vignon, and once you reset Vignon, you should be able to actually see the arms jiggle. Now, if by any chance, let's say, for example, um, the arms don't jiggle as much, then please make sure you play around with these settings here. And you can, um, also play around with the multiplier here. I set mine, um... I believe I'm not I don't remember the default setting it was mine is set to 1.5 but I don't remember in the recording of the video what the number exactly is but you can definitely play with the settings and such experiment and all that see what is best for you and yeah pretty much um that should pretty much show you how to do the arms uh the arm jiggle basically uh, for your 3D model, basically. That way you can emulate, um, pretty much a live 2D look to it. Uh, you could do a lot of other things as well, but definitely just take your time playing with it and study the node graph, um, it, like, study and practice. There's gonna be a lot of failures if you're gonna try something completely different from Armsway, but I definitely will say, um, this is at least a start to at least gain, you know, gain that more live 2D sort of feel because, you know, live 2D models are more bouncier and such, so... Yeah, it helps a lot. Um, but yeah, um, if you have any other questions, please let me know. I'd be happy to help you out. And yeah, with that being said, though, I hope you have a lovely day. And heika heika heika, sign it out, everyone. I hope to see you guys next time, okay? Bye-bye! And also, excuse the um, iPhone delay. iFacial MoCap is being a little baka right now. But bye-bye!